you about him. Yep. Uh, and don't move him like that. If you want him more upright, adjust the bed. I'm sorry, Miss Collins. I'll do it myself. I'm gonna go check on the latest blood gas. <sighs> I've never seen a good one like this before. Matt, all I know is that when Sharon was graduating from high school, Reggie came back from Nam. They practically spent the entire summer together. It was her first real love. So why didn't it work out? Well, Reggie wanted her to travel the world with him, but Sharon was going to college in the fall, and then Bert came along, and there was just... If you had listened to me earlier, we wouldn't be out of options. I'm sorry, Mrs. Gilwin. What's going on? The infiltrates in Reggie's lungs. Complete whiteout. They're barely functioning. So what do we do now? Miss Kidwin, the condition his lungs are in, there's very little hope for recovery. We should try to make him comfortable. What about ECMO? I'm afraid all ECMO will do is delay the inevitable. I have been listening to your advice all day. And look where we are. Miss Goodwin, all due respect, both Dr. Manning and I are telling you that it isn't going to help. Your concerns are noted, Dr. Choi. Put him on ECMO. I can assign this case to another doctor, if you Sharon. prefer. We'll do it. What? We will put Reggie on ECMO. Call up to the ICU. I'll take care of the arrangements myself. 